or make you laugh, make you cry like ain't life funny. Ugh. Cause like I'll tell you another story, right? And like this oh, leads no. to a, a topic for today too. But one time I was in Orlando um later on down the road when we had graduated school and stuff and uh this guys that i was shooting videos with i didn't really know them that well uh we're walking down the street and this other group of guys i guess we were walking too slow for them but like just pushes their way through us like they're hard you know what i'm saying like obviously trying to start some shit and like bump some people and one of the guys uh that's with us says man it's a lot of faggots in la i mean in uh orlando i'm sorry and when he says that, uh, the guy that bumped into him turns around and says, what you say? He said, I said, you're a fag. You're a fucking fag, fag, faggity, fag, fag, fag. And what? then the guy, yeah, like straight up says this to this dude. And like, I hadn't been drinking that night. Like, I had been shooting videos. You know what I'm saying? All these other guys were a little bit. So this, videos. okay, set the scene though. This wasn't like broad daylight. This was in the at night. Nighttime, you guys were like doing Downtown clubs. Orlando oh, at the corner, gosh. like in the middle of like where all this shit is happening. You know what I'm saying? Basically, right? Downtown so, like, Orlando people, is yeah. basically a terrible the place. <laughs> working yeah. And these guys... Hustle. Like, legitimately, these guys were out of hand because, like, if somebody is in your way, you could have said, excuse me, you know what I'm saying? Like, they didn't have to do what they did. So I understand why the guy kind of popped off on them for saying that. But at the same time, our boy didn't have to, like, that we were with, didn't have to call him the F word, like, 20 times, bro. Yeah. But what they do, to their credit, I guess they must have had pe other people with them or they just was feeling swole that night or whatever. They disappeared. And we were actually waiting for another guy with us to come out the club. So we were, like, standing on that corner just shooting the shit and it was like other people with us that like once again this group of people that was with us did not know these guys that well and like we were all just kind of like light acquaintances you know what i'm saying so we're just out there kind of just like lightly chatting and then these guys come back from three different angles one comes from one side one comes from another one comes from another and for whatever reason there's some white boy shit because these were white dudes I don't know I mean, why y'all. I could, was, I I could smell yeah. it just in the story. Yeah. I was like, this doesn't yeah. sound like anything but pure whiteness right now. Yeah. So. Well, they hey, this is Josh. If anybody knows Cam, tell him his bitch ass has got something coming for him. Because I'm not going to motherfucking fuck with his damn bullshit. If anybody knows Cam, you better send him a message telling that Josh said he's got something coming for him and he's got something waiting on him. So yep. tell him to bring his bitch ass on, motherfucking money stealing bitch.